Now, now at 5 o'clock, heartburn is a very common problem, but some it's so bad it keeps them up at night. But now there's new help for heartburn, and 7's Richard Lemus explains. For almost two years, Madeline Dominguez didn't know what was wrong with her. I started to feel a pain right, right here in my stomach that would literally wake up in the middle of the night. The burning sensation would keep her up for hours, and she nearly had to sleep sitting up. I had to prop up myself with the pills, and it was very uncomfortable for me um, to sleep that way. Madeline was suffering from severe heartburn or acid reflux. The symptoms include uh, burning sensation in your chest, as food coming up into your, uh, into your mouth, into your esophagus after eating heavy meals. Dr. Eddie Gomez says occasional heartburn is normal and can be treated with over-the-counter medication. But if the pain happens every day or affects sleep or how you eat, it could be more serious. Once it becomes uh, um, three or four times a week or a daily basis or the patient is chronically taking medication to take care of this problem, we should look uh, further into it and should be evaluated. Doctors at Jackson South Community Hospital are using a new procedure that fixes a problem permanently. Basically recreating the valve of the lower esophagus that prevents the reflux of the acids from the stomach into the uh, uh, esophagus. It's called a suffix. Doctors use a special instrument with a camera on the end guiding it down the throat into the esophagus. They recreate the valve that separates the stomach from the esophagus to block the acid from going up into the chest. With no scars, no incisions, and patients go home basically uh, after the procedure a couple hours. A month after the procedure, Madeline was able to go back to eating the food she loves, and she stopped having to take prescription acid blockers. Plus, she's also finally getting her Z's. I like sleep like a baby now. <laughs> so definitely, I feel great. I think it was the best decision I made. Dr. Gomez says the procedure has an 85% success rate. For more information, log on to our website. In the Plex, I'm Richard Lemus, 7 News.